Peter Sellers exposed the bizarre realities behind the laughter. Imagine a renowned actor, famed for his comedic genius, yet in interviews, he mirrors a Gestapo officer's demeanor. Now, add a twist of deep-rooted superstitions, a man who shuddered at the sight of the colors green and purple. This is not a character from one of his films, this is the enigmatic Peter Sellers. Welcome to Freaky Facts, History's Oddities, where we delve into the strange and lesser-known aspects of a man who both captivated and perplexed the world. In today's journey through Freaky Facts, History's Oddities, we're peeling back the layers of Peter Sellers, a man whose talent shone brightly on the silver screen, yet whose life off-camera was shrouded in mystery and complexity. From his early days in show business, to his rise as a Hollywood icon, Sellers' life was a tapestry of brilliant performances, personal struggles, and eccentricities that few knew. We'll explore his tumultuous personal life, his unique approach to comedy, and the lesser-known quirks that made him a figure of intrigue and fascination. So, sit back as we uncover the untold stories of a man who was as enigmatic in life as he was in his art. Peter Sellers' journey began far from the glitz of Hollywood, in the world of variety shows and radio. His early life was marked by a foray into entertainment through BBC's The Goon Show, setting the stage for a career filled with diverse and memorable roles. But it wasn't just his talent that made him stand out. Sellers was a man of many faces, both on and off the screen. His portrayal in Stanley Kubrick's Lolita and his iconic role as Inspector Clouseau in the Pink Panther series catapulted him to international fame. However, behind the laughter and applause lay a tumultuous personal life. Sellers was a man of superstitions and bizarre aversions, particularly to the colors green and purple, which he believed brought bad luck. His onset behavior was often unpredictable, marked by sudden tantrums and mood swings, suggesting a deeper struggle with mental health. The spotlight on Sellers' life intensifies as we explore his marriage to Britt Eklund. Their relationship was as passionate as it was volatile, mirroring the chaos of his professional life. Sellers' health began to decline, marked by heart attacks and professional setbacks, including difficulties during the filming of Casino Royale. The disintegration of his marriage to Eklund was not just a personal failure, but a reflection of the inner turmoil that plagued his life. As the 1970s dawned, Peter Sellers found himself at a crossroads, navigating the complexities of fame and personal hardship. He embraced the role of Inspector Clouseau in the Pink Panther series with renewed vigor, a character that not only brought him immense fame, but also became synonymous with his identity as an actor. The series, with its blend of slapstick humor and witty dialogue, became a global phenomenon, cementing Seller's status as a comedic legend. However, the bright lights of Hollywood often cast long shadows. Behind the laughter and acclaim, Sellers was wrestling with deep-seated mental health issues that frequently manifested in erratic behavior and mood swings. These struggles were not just confined to the sets of his films, they spilled over into his personal life, which was as tumultuous as any script he had performed. Sellers' romantic life was a carousel of relationships, marked by multiple marriages that each told a story of love, conflict, and eventual dissolution. His marriages were reflections of his search for stability and happiness, yet they often ended in heartache and controversy. This period was also marked by Sellers' increasing superstitions and peculiar behaviors, which added to the complexity of his relationships both on and off the set. This era of Sellers' life was a tapestry of contrasting threads, the joy and laughter he brought to audiences around the world, and the personal battles he fought behind closed doors. It was a time when his brilliance as an actor was often overshadowed by the struggles he faced in his own life, struggles that would continue to define him in the years to come. Despite his professional success, Sellers' demons cast a long shadow, 
his behavior became increasingly erratic, and his refusal to seek professional help for his mental health struggles only exacerbated the situation. His life was a constant battle between his public persona as a comedic genius and his private struggles with emotional instability. In his later years, Seller's health continued to decline. His refusal to seek medical help was a decision that would have lasting consequences. In 1980, at the age of 54, the world lost Peter Sellers to a heart attack. Peter Sellers was more than just an actor, he was a study in contrasts. A man who could bring joy to millions while struggling with his inner turmoil. His legacy in the entertainment industry is undeniable, but it is his enigmatic personality and the untold stories of his life that continue to fascinate and intrigue us to this day. As we reach the end of our journey through the life of Peter Sellers, we're left with the image of a man who was as complex as he was talented. His ability to bring characters to life on screen was unparalleled, yet his own life was filled with challenges and contradictions. Sellers' legacy in film and comedy is undeniable, but it's the untold stories, the hidden struggles, and the personal battles that make his story truly captivating. What do you think was the most intriguing aspect of Peter Sellers' life? Was it his unparalleled talent, his tumultuous personal life, or the mysteries that surrounded him? Share your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this deep dive into the enigmatic world of Peter Sellers, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Freaky Facts, History's Oddities. For more fascinating journeys into the lives of history's most intriguing figures, your support helps us bring more of these stories to light. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for more oddities and untold tales from history.